Really looking forward to round 16 action in the VFL. Peter Mercado, it's such a close season, isn't it? And we've had, it obviously looks very different this year. And this week we're going to Punt Road Oval. We're seeing the Tigers host Port Melbourne. The Bar are locked in the top two. And Richmond, well, they're still knocking on the door. They give themselves an outside chance at the finals. Well, Darren, they had a huge win uh, a round ago against Geelong. They were mm. down at half time and they ran over the top and scored a really big win there. That'll give their young side plenty of confidence. They have been up and down this season. They've had some key wins along the way, but the pressure goes up a gear. They need to keep winning to have any chance of making the finals. It's a huge test against Port Melbourne, who sit in that those top reaches of the ladder. And it just seems to be that Gary Ayres is able to regenerate his team, get them back to the top of the ladder, mm. and in competitive force, they, they're one of the premiership favourites. Well, there's no doubt. And it, it, it is remarkable, as you say, the way that Gary Ayres has been able to maintain that team and sustain the, the, that, that real top-level talent. But they have shown some fractures lately. We thought they were invincible after about eight weeks. But then all of a sudden, they dropped a couple of games seemingly out of nowhere. So there are some cracks there. I'm just not quite sure whether Richmond are going to have the talent available to, to actually exploit it. You, you mentioned they've been up and down and they've had some injury problems, but it's got to be a mindset thing as well for them. Well, the other thing you throw into the mix is uh, the AFL side and, and mm. how they're travelling. They're obviously not going to be making the finals. Does Damien Hardwick decide to bring in some of these younger players from the VFL to try and make an impact? The good news, I guess, for Richmond fans is that they've got a really strong VFL core who are able to stand up week in, week out. It just depends on the players who are sort of drifting between yeah. the AFL team and the VFL team. That'll be a key in this match because, as we know, Port being a standalone side and a quality lineup, they've been pretty settled for a while now. Yeah, without a doubt. But the game should be a ripper. Really looking forward to it. It's coming up this Saturday afternoon, right, here, right on ABC Television. It's going to be the Round 16 action right around Victoria, live from one o'clock. It's going to be Richmond and Port Melbourne. The other games in Round 16, well, it's a, it's a brief round, Round 16, with a handful of teams with the buys. Uh, Box Hill Hawks hosting Coburg in a game that the home sign will be favoured to win. Williamstown will have a bit of a challenge against the Bendigo Gold in their one of their last half a dozen games in their career in the VFL. And Frankston and Collingwood, well, it's going to be a really interesting clash on the field and in the grandstands, I suspect, down at Frankston Oval on <laughs> Sunday afternoon, the Dolphins and the Magpies in round 16.